<laughs> what do you reckon? Can we do a James Bond style corkscrew jump off of this? <laughs> So I get a lot of comments with people saying, Kev, where's the UDR? So it's been off the road for a little while because I've been waiting for some new drive shafts and I've given up waiting for the Traxxas ones. So I've gone ahead and bought some eBay specials. These are supposed to be made at hardened steel. So I've got one eBay one in there, one stock one. So in this video, we're going to give it a rip and see if they're any good. Look, that's how long it's been standing for. And we got some brand new lipos from Genzace. Oh man, I'm starving. Oh, guys, I love my cereals. Trouble is, they're not very healthy. I need to get rid of this thing. So Magic Spoon have sent me these. We got zero grams of sugar, 14 grams of protein, and only four grams net carbs per serving. And only 140 to 170 calories, depending which flavor you go with. You can try Magic Spoon's best-selling flavors in a four flavor variety pack, including coca, my favorite, fruity, which is quite lemony, frosted, and peanut butter. To me, they taste better than my childhood favorites, and they're super healthy. It's keto friendly, gluten free, grain free, soy free, low carbs, and none of that dodgy GMO stuff. So click the link below to grab a variety pack and try it out today. And be sure to use promo code Kevin Talbot at checkout and get $5 off any order. Or go to magicspoon.com forward slash Kevin Talbot. Magic Spoon is so confident in their product, it's backed with a 100% happiness guarantee. So if you don't like it for any reason, they will refund you your money, no questions asked. So Click the link down below and use the code Kevin Talbot for $5 off or go to magicspoon.com forward slash Kevin Talbot to save $5 today. So I just want to say a massive thanks to Magic Spoon for sponsoring this video and sending me these cereals. When I've run out of these, I will definitely be getting some more. Oh, what? It doesn't fit! <laughs> They're just that little bit too big. But they'll fit the Creighton perfectly, so we're gonna save them for that. So in this video, we're gonna revert back to the trusty Fluions. Alright, enough waffling, let's give it a rip! <laughs> Oh, that flies more than normal. Oh no! Oh, oh no, it's broken. It's come off. Got no parts? Nope. Game over. Oh, look at that. It just snapped the axle clean off. You should have bought your x max yep. <laughs> Yeah. So that one's broken, but here's Dean in the house. And. Oh! This is a free grand jobby. Free grand? Oh, three, two. What have you, you done to it? Everything, fighter on. Everything they make. So he's got the rear axle. Oh, that looks nice. It's got all the drop links, everything. Look at the front end, look at these. Oh these. my god, did you build that? Did I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, tumble one bolt, and he saved it. Oh, I just missed it. We've done a little jump, and he's killed it. The wheels come off. Oh no, he done what I did. The same. Snap the axle. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got the spare part, we're going to whip it on and then we're going to carry on bashing and also I want to see how fast it goes. This is a little GPS, if you want to know where to get one from, link down below and also link down below where you can get that from and everything else in this video. And the suspension on this is epic. All right, let's rip. <laughs> All right, how fast do you reckon it's going to go? I'm going to go with 50. I don't know. Where the EXP quicker? Could be 50. All right, 50 it is then. Oh. <laughs> Have a look. 44. <laughs> <laughs> so it used to go 50 mile an hour on my old Gen's Ace battery. The trouble is the new ones don't fit. So we ran it on these old Fluions. These are really tired. I've had them for years. Stempy's kind of mudded this one up a little bit. And I think now they've lost most of their performance. <laughs> All right. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Footage. You're not well, it? Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> What's she doing? GR versus Ready, steady, go, 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 go! Oh, and the UDR's off! Oh, he got ripped! Yeah, move to Charlie's Mini, it might cost you a pound. Oh, they're all stuck together, aren't they? Put a pound in. I'll put that in Audi. <laughs> right. Ian's got the felony. Who's going in Audi first then? Probably you. Ready, steady, go! Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh, who was that? Claire, what are you doing? I'm getting the thumb now. Oi! <laughs> I'm filming, it's all right. I'm not being in awe, but I'm recording. Oh, I'm in! I'm in! <laughs> Parked it. It's not a bike rack, you know. <laughs> oh, look, it's trying to come out, look. Hey! <laughs> you gave birth to it. That's come out there. What did you hit, Benny? Sideways on. Got a little dent in the chassis, but it shoved the motor to the side. It's been the chassis and it's moved the motor sideways. You ready? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what a save! <laughs> what do you reckon? Can we use that as a ramp? <laughs> Footage. <laughs> I'm trying to do a 360 and land it on wheels. <laughs> One more, I don't want to kill it. Oh, nearly. Ready, steady, go. UDR's off. Hold on the brakes. Oh, oh no. Oh. oh, no, I just hit the post. Oh, I broke it. Steering's gone. Oh, yeah, look. Whose fault was that? Oh, oh no. Oh! Yeah. Oh no. That that got proper rear ended. Whose fault was it, Claire? Your fault. What do you guys reckon? Whose fault was it? We've got to hit an apple with that flat out and see what happens. We've got a drink bottle. Do you reckon it will cut the bottom of that off? All right, there we go. I might risk my GoPro. Oh no, I'm putting the GoPro on the floor. Is it going to survive? That's my good GoPro, that one. Try not to hit it. Here we go. Oh no! Kind of alright. That ain't. Oh. <laughs> and they weren't even filming. 